What's up, YouTube? Doomsoul here, and welcome to Will Fight for Food Super Actual Shutout Game of the Hour. Oh, or with fifth, with fourth, with with sa sas goth goth with with sas goth. Let's start. Easy. Very easy. Kind of held his sword entirely. Play what? Rainbow mode, normal mode, hardcore mode, or barbed wire mode. Let's go normal. Oh, a costume. Entangled in space and time. Found in the sewer, red hate hit shot with a coat. Smooth, colorful, and older than you. Equipped even at home in a speedy disco or in a city in Ninja. Not enough office to go around, and the underclass are starting to get desperate. Classic Jared for those with those. JRPs. Any more? Yeah! Greetings! Sometimes you're gonna purchase. This feline themed outfit is not one of those. Gear War for fist fighting the Pope in the sense that this one he was wearing at the time. Satan which makes you dress like this, but teenage you thinks this outfit is cool. You fear that quacks. You, you are the fear that quacks in the evening. You are the pet that scratches the furniture. Unleash the hashtag baker inside to hashtag 360 no scope. Hashtag 420 glaze it. Hashtag smoke wheat. Hashtag eat the pie. Hashtag cake shot. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm looking for. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Whatville Fighting. Alright, um, as chairman of the WFF, I've never seen such a lineup of talented brawlers. What do you think, viewers? Can Jared the Red Raptor? <laughs> Can. The Red Raptor Dent hold his title against all comers, including the Knights. Mystery Fighter. There's only one way to find out as the crowd shakes, the excitement, and screams all across the city are tuning in. But then with wind us. Jared, are you drunk? <laughs> Why? Dent. <laughs> Lily. My name's Jared Dent. Completely hammered, yes. Five minutes into our first round out, it's Red Rider versus the Marine! <laughs> I'm sorry, what's this guy wearing? <laughs> I am the mouse! <laughs> My parents were Donald and Goofy. What? You're supposed to go seven rounds? Okay. To hand off your hand your head off to Karate Kim. What the hell's wrong with you? I fucking don't know. Hi! Hector! Like metaphorically, or do you want specific brands? Jared, this is about handing over the title. There's more to life than being the WFF champ. Why don't you come to me this Sunday to do an illegal fishing tournament? An illegal fight. Fishing! We're illegally fishing! <laughs> the Popo won't stop us now! Alright. Fighting tournament where pain is king, fear is god, and groin shots from the local district courts. I, I was gonna say church, but I'll simultaneously change my mind and double down on that idea. For Pete's sake, Jared, just don't, like, don't, don't you dare let anybody down tonight. What, what are these down here? I got a uh, inventory, journal, and options. Um, inventory. Wow, I don't know how, how long is this game. This game just came out, by the way, guys, on the twenty second. Uh, so. Uh, you, you're gonna be seeing this like on the 29th or 30th. If I don't know how long this game is, if it goes over 20 minutes, I'll probably split it up in parts. Uh, you guys are stupid too. It's a direct link to Whatville's Black Little Monster Heart. If you act like an idiot out there, they'll hey, maybe you're gonna be the new champ. You're a big patriot guy. Maybe that's what kids like now. Nationalism? I don't know. I haven't seen the spreadsheet, but there's only one belt I care about. Dent the mayor belt. That's the mayor. That's the mayor, this shirtless guy, consistently flexing his left shoulder. Only his left shoulder, with one hand in his sweatpants, wearing white shoes that are nondescript. He's mayor? Alright, well, hi, mayor. You wanna go out there and throw out your goodwill on the same night you lose your champion status? Fine. I guess being on top was I had to be going for you anyway. Hi, Batmouse! Or Steve. Are you kidding me? She's going to go all seven rounds tonight. I'm number six. 
See you in like six minutes with Thrum. It's all about you, isn't it? This is really the champion. This is your time, and it must be all about you. I mean, contractually speaking. They're not even trying to make me look good tonight. I don't look like some chump ass in a koala suit again. When by all rights, I should look like a sexy egg and get eh, attic heart dog in a koala suit. Well, you know what? What? Oh, one of these is gonna be Koala Man's turn. Bukowinski. Koala time is on the wax, and when it arrives, I'm gonna laugh right in your ugly goddamn face! Man, you are really tense, bro. You need a back massage? Mm, mm. Oh, oh, I can walk up and down. You need a back massage, Koala Man? Koala Man? Mm, mm. I'm inside you. <sighs> Anyways, hi. Hey, Lou. I got a couple minutes. Want to throw breadcrumbs and mice to the mutant raccoons? Jer Bear, tonight is going to be so awesome. I finally got to drop my signature Texas mistake on you in round five. My action figures are going to go, blow up. I can pay off that mob, gu mob guy. Oh, yeah, look. Uh, hypothetically, if your action figures do start selling really good, maybe put some of that money aside. Invest or something. Don't just take it for granted. Yeah. Or I can take out two mob loans with the collateral. You know the replicas of the one-tenth scale early modern battleships I can buy that kind of money? Like, one and a half! Y you have a problem. Hi, Kurt. Hi! Ambiguously Asian karate person. We haven't met yet. My name's Jared. Fun fact about me, you're about to ruin my life. Because I'm going to be the next WFF champion? A little bit about that. Listen, I overheard the Marine backstage, and he seems to be planning... Hey, love to stay in chat, but I've got a match against the Marine to win while drunk and emotionally crippled. Man, good thing he's throwing the match, or I'd be in some deep dip. He's not throwing the match, is he? Whoa, well, okay, I'm here now. Hello, M. Markiplier, are you? So, you're two pieces of bad news for whoever's reading this. First of all, you're gonna be you're gonna be me today. Second, WFS sake, or at least, okay, fake. Script said I was gonna lose in round seven. The Marine caught me off guard with his signature and put me in the hospital. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, I didn't even get to see the fight. I just you're down in round one. The change was fake, but that part where I got completely lost, bona fide. You're welcome, fans. When I woke up, the Marine was champion. Also, a WFF fan full of lawyers were pulling in the parking lot. Good thing I was already planning on skipping town to dodge those medical bills. Haha. <laughs> oh God. But all that was a while ago. I've grown since then, mostly in the bicep and callus areas, but there's also some transformative experience involving railway police and a one-eyed bootlegger. Introspection is one of the many things that never came easy to me, but something about the serenity of the open road, the isolation of all my old cronies and mobs and screaming fans helped me find my first real purpose in life. I was gonna hunt down the marine and beat him like a churlish pinata. I didn't care how many goons he had, or how big a fortress mansion I had to fight through, or what kind of sinister conspiracy he would doubtless turn out to be invested in by now, there's one thing I was sure of. His days of glory were at an end. Your glory days are over, pal. Get your card ride, get your cardboard Shangri-La off my lawn. Show me first. I want to see the actual rule of the homeowner's guideline, which says, No mold streaked packing material palaces. Also, shot in the dark, do you happen to have any spare diabetes medication? Oh. I'm gonna get a creepy feeling this won't be the good the feel good cinematic redemption I've been lusting for. I guess the one with one of those classic bif bifurcated moral highways. How am I gonna see improve myself the better man? Kill my ass down and broken and really prove myself the better man. Yeah! Well take what it is I got options. Maybe I'll talk to everyone before I kick someone to death. Hmm. Or, you're gonna fuck down, bitch! Oh, Z is punch, X is kick, C is shoulder barge. So, Oh, yeah, you're going down, bitch. Hooah! Oh, yeah. What you gonna do about it? What you gonna do? Huh? Let it be a lesson for all of you! Cross me now, wait until your life is ruined, and make it pointlessly worse! Oh, whoa, hello. Oh, different areas of the city. I, so I'm here then. I'm... Uh, hospital closed. Uh, that might be a problem. Wait, no. No service. I'm on my smoke break. Are you on the doctor here? There's, they're also on the smoke breaks. When will it be done? 
No. I feel like on the north of some insidious, horrifying facade. I can shout with the barest exertion of mental energy. You gonna? Eh. I mean, yes! Yeah! Ow, 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 ow! Piss off! This guy is so much stronger than the Marine. Yeah, I got... What'd I get? A map? Okay. I am... Close to almost dead. I guess I should go here? Oh, hey! I remember you! You're... You own a food truck. What the? Jared, you're alive! At what point after I left, people just decided I was dead? Man, we threw a wake at noon the day after! Marcos catered. P and Lily left after we ran out of the breadstick dip. It's good to see ya! How you been eating? Our state troopers after you? If you need a free meal or getaway vehicle, my truck's open, man. Uh. Everything alright? Oh, it's better to be able to. a little friction between me and our old friend Peter. We had a professional conflict. The classic rivalry between food cup captain and lo pretty local executive. Oh no, you see, that was back when I had an up and coming. <laughs> I was just a pretty. Oh, okay. I was an up and coming assassin. Believe me, we locked horns. As in, I throw a javelin at him. What? Could you actually ask him to not have your revenge killed? I've been spying on him. I'm pretty sure he's serious. I'm totally going to move on if he is. Uh, all right. I'll go talk to that guy, and by talk to him. I mean, kick his ass. Alright. Up here, then? Sup, all you people. You seem important. Let's talk to you. I mean, let's talk to you. Tour ended four hours ago. Apartments ended three hours. Appointments ended three hours ago. You're not a lobbyist. You are actually covered in bloodstains. Can I help you? Uh, me and Petey go way back. Way back is then you're here to political favors, or is then you're here to beg for free ones. I used to him a lot. Yeah, I'm not letting you in. Shucks. Actually, you know what? He could use a contact like you. Just don't do anything stupid, like have opinions or raise your hands above your waist. And you should make it through this, through this biologically intact. Oh, uh, no problem. Let's go, bitch! Okay. <laughs> Wait, are you on my schedule? Let's see. Thursday, meet with Reek Salesman Incontinent. Sorry, not saying. Get the hell out of my office. Peter, it's me! Jared from the WFF. Does this powerful chin and handsome upper lip ring a bell? Oh my, Jared Dent. It's really you. You're alive. Get the hell out of my office. But hadn't got body language, aggressive, disagree, insult. So I was or just unbelievably stupid. Honestly, you know what? Screw it. I don't care. She's off my menu for now. Just as so long as she signs the letters of apologies to Mary and myself. Don't ask why I had this pre-written and lying around. Sometimes I just gotta get to myself the other day. Did the hacks break her too? No, it just me. She didn't bother calling her to schedule it. She didn't! <laughs> Call him. Excuse me, sir. Yeah. I'd like to schedule your murder. Yeah, you know, fuck you. 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 I want to start building far more pretty talk on Tuesday. Negativity protesting, book club starting, cable watching, third party voting, laser hating squash in your. Haha, you're a little bump, you're an LA regional store by coordination. <coughs> I'm sorry. Ah. <sighs> I did screw you, and I will talk about it. I'll tell everyone not even think about what I'm worth doing. Now give me your mayoral title belt, I'm gonna hit the town tonight. Yeah, I called security. Ah, of course you did. Alright. HOLY SHIT! Down, bitches! Down, bitch. You too. Yeah, go down, bitch. Yeah, you too. 
Alright. You look important. Yeah, everyone here is down now. And I don't like any of you. Oh. Oh shit! Wait, no, I'm sorry! I'm sorry, Lou, sorry! Ow! No, you didn't do it. Do it again? Alright. There. That's the most recent one, I think. Alright. Alright, I won't kill everyone, I guess. I just have to ask for those apology letters. Great news! I got your pardon. Or reprieve. He is seriously considering not killing you. I don't actually have English as a word for this. Aw, oh, Jerry Bear! I know you kind of you. Fix this stuff is like your superpower or something. You do actually have to sign this letter that you're sorry. Take a look. Concern the president here, my obscurious policy, surrender, or impact of religious self termination, I ever again. I'm gonna go ahead and guess these aren't legally binding. With a fleck of dirt and the fingernails of a giant, I should know not to fear the little hooked metal attachment of fate. I ask not to escape your wrath and only wrathful mention in the four volume mail order biography that is now being written. Mail order? So behind the times. Most of it was replaced by fax now, right? I. Jerry, sure, thanks so much for helping your third person. I'm not going to sign this. Awesome! I'll go beat him up! Way easier! Pardon me. Sup, Mr. President? Yeah, not reading that one again. Yeah, that was already, uh... Yeah, I I'm not gonna scream in your ass's ear again. Yeah, get down! BAM! Kick their asses. Yeah! What do you have to say about that? Boot it up for you. Oh wow, what does this look like? Initially, kind of like an old-fashioned frog, scanned out by an explicit scene on daytime television. As I hear we have a concave thing going. We'll always have the good times, Jared. People may leave us behind, but we'll always have the good times. Did you that thing out? We got the cob off your back or what? Eh. But it doesn't feel all gratifying and junk food to, uh, bubbly, big ol' murderer, probably the only person that likes you. Oh gosh darn it, I just did one of these! I need to set all three of these. Body language should be relaxed and agree. Opinion should be indifferent and the tone should be sincere. There. Oh. Okay, I think I'm lost. Damn it! Can you just beat him up? Body language. Aggressive, agree. S sincere. Ag there. Or the no Oh, wait, security. Violence! That does seem to be a fundamental axis upon which our worlds turn. Yes, I guess. Alright, somebody's getting beat up by. Do I. Does it go beat him up again? Or something? Wait, do I, do I have to beat up the president again? I mean, I will. You don't need this security guy, right? Yeah, kicks! Can't handle my kicks. Yeah, he's down. Alright. Um, you two. Yeah, I don't, we don't have janitors. You're a bitch, too. You know, you're kind of a bitch. You... I don't know why, but... I don't like you. I... What happened, officer? I just... I, it went dark for a second, and... And then they were all on the floor, and I was sitting here with all this blood covering myself. I have no idea what happened. Well, anyway, guys, that is We'll Fight for Food, Super Actual Sellout, Game of the Hour Edition. 
edition or maybe just game of the hour anyways this is a really fun game so far the music is amazing so far and I just beat the shit out of the president so thank you all so much for watching I highly recommend you take a look at this game there's a link in the description to the game's website and as always have a great day